Okay, here with head track and field coach Alston Ben. Alston, just start off by talking about how the indoor season went and um, just what you were most impressed with. Yeah, so um, we had a really, really phenomenal indoor season. Our men won their second straight conference title. Um, and then coming off of that, you know, we went to nationals and, and finished with our highest ever finish for the men um, with an eighth place finish, um, which puts our men's program um, sitting, I believe, second in the country um, in the program of the year standings. And then our women, they had a conference runner-up finish um, and actually scored the most points we've ever scored. Um, I don't know the number off the top of my head, but um, and then came to nationals and, and Caitlin Shoemaker was an All-American. And then um, that put our women sitting as the 24th best program um, in the country. Um, so yeah, so really excited about, you know, how the indoor season went. We continue to grow as a track program. Um, so, uh, you know, I think we'll keep going that direction as we, as we move forward. So We had one outdoor meet already, but talk about the grind that these athletes go through. I mean, the indoor season seems like it was so recent, but then outdoor event comes up. Just what's the mental preparation for those kids that compete every week? Yeah, so um, it's tough. You know, the, the distance athletes, they compete from basically the last week in August all the way till the end of May. Um, we're one of the unique sports uh, that, that's like that, that just competes all year long. Um, so, you know, it is difficult. And even, you know, the sprinters, a lot of times they start practice, you know, the beginning of September um, and, and train and train and train um, and then start competing in January or actually December for some of them and then again go all the way through May. So it is a long season, um, but ideally, you know, we, we try to prepare them for that and, and um, you know, it's really a big important part of our culture as a program is just being passionate about the sport. Um, and as long as you're passionate about the sport, you look forward to those opportunities you get to compete as opposed to dreading, you know, being doing it nine straight months out of the year. So, um, so yeah, so it's, you know, it's, it's tough sometimes and you have your ups and downs, but, you know, we try to let them have some fun and, and enjoy themselves sometimes as well. So it makes it where, you know, you get through it. So. First home event Friday, Ottawa Park, Avila coming here. What's going to be the key to just kind of keeping the guys focused and what's the excitement going into it? Yeah, so one of the cool things about this meet is we do a little quad meet. Um, it's kind of, this is really our, our season opener. We did bring some kids to Memphis last week, some of our sprinters, jumpers, throwers, to get them some warmer weather early season. Um, but this is really our, our opener for the season where we have pretty much the whole team competing. Um, but it's a small meet, four teams, quad meet, it's scored. So every, every athlete matters, every athlete gets points. Um, and it really brings back track and field a little bit. Because one of the things with track is that a lot of times it's this 10, 12 hour event. This, the meet this weekend lasts about four hours. Um, the events on the track are gonna be crammed in about two and a half hours. So you can really come and watch the event and enjoy um, you know, track and field um, and just you know, different events one right after, one right after the other. Um, so it's, it's really gonna be, it's gonna be scored and it actually, there's a team aspect to it and it doesn't make it so individual. So that's what's cool about it too, is our team gets to go out there and compete for a team title early season, which we usually don't get to do until a conference meet. So, you know, these guys are gonna, and girls are gonna be competing and, and trying to, you know, bring home a trophy this weekend, which is a lot of fun. It's something we don't usually get to do in, in March. So that's kind of what allows us to focus is it's not about them, it's about the team this weekend, so. All right, coach, we'll see you Friday and good luck. Cool, thanks.